Smiley Drug. Hello, welcome to Ask Marley Drug. My name is Monica and I'm a pharmacist who works with Marley Drug Pharmacy. So today we're going to talk about commonly asked questions I get from medication called mycophenolate, also known as Celsep. Plus, I'm going to share with you some side effects you should be aware of while taking mycophenolate. So what is mycophenolate and how does it work? Well, mycophenolate is a prescription medication that's part of a drug class of medications known as immunosuppressants. These medications suppress the activity of your immune system, hence the name immunosuppressants, and are often used to prevent organ rejection after transplantation. In other words, when someone has had a liver, kidney, or heart transplant and is at least three months old, this medication is administered to stop organ rejection. To avoid organ transplant rejection, mycophenolate is often used in combinations with other medications. This medication is available on our Marley Drug website in 500 mg tablet as well as 250 mg capsule. It is recommended to take this medication on an empty stomach either one hour before or two hours after meals, unless otherwise instructed by your doctor. If your doctor recommends taking this medication with food, ensure consistency by always taking it with meals. This helps maintain steady medication levels in your body. What if I miss a dose? Mycophenolate should be taken at roughly the same time every day so you don't forget to take it and receive the full benefit of this medication. However, if you do forget to take a dose, then take it, unless your next scheduled dose is within two hours. In that case, skip the missed dose and continue your regular dosing schedule, but do not take two doses at one time. If you consistently miss doses, it is recommended to speak with your healthcare provider or pharmacist as this may increase your risk of transplant rejection. What are the common side effects of this medication? Well, like all medications, mycophenolate has a few side effects. Some common side effects include abdominal pain, nausea, vomiting, diarrhea or constipation, swelling in your ankles or feet, dizziness, headache, weakness, fever, cold symptoms, tremor or shakiness, muscle, neck or back pain, high or low blood pressure, high blood sugar, low blood potassium levels, increased heart rate, having difficulty sleeping, or having signs of an infection. So if you are experiencing any of these side effects, be sure to talk with your healthcare provider to determine whether a dose adjustment or switching to a different medication would be beneficial for you. So what are the serious side effects of this medication? Some serious side effects of mycophenolate that you should be aware of include having signs of a serious infection, including symptoms such as cough, difficulty breathing, diarrhea, weakness, sweating, changes in personality, changes in vision, sensitivity to light, or seizures, or having a fever of at least 100.5 Fahrenheit or higher, painful blistering rash that develops on one side of your body, cold or flu-like symptoms, loss of smell and or taste, weakness that develops on one side of your body, loss of muscle co control, disorientation, pain around your transplanted organ, pain or burning when you urinate or dark urine, jaundice or yellowing of your eyes or skin, or blood in your urine or stool, unexplained bruising, or bleeding that takes longer than usual to stop. So if you're experiencing any of these serious side effects, immediately call your doctor and stop taking this medication. Keep in mind that those taking this medication have a higher risk of developing cancers, including lymphomas and skin cancer, among other types. This risk is potentially associated with the duration and extent of immune system suppression. What should I avoid while taking this medication? While taking mycophenolate, it is important to be aware of certain precautions and activities to avoid, including immunizations with live vaccines, such as Verivax or Varicella, which may be less effective or could be risky while on this medication. It is recommended to speak with your doctor before receiving any live vaccines. This medication can also increase your susceptibility to sunburn. It is recommended to avoid sunlight and tanning beds and instead wear protective clothing and apply sunscreen with an SPF of 30 or higher when outdoors. It is important to avoid donating blood or sperm while taking this medication and for a minimum of 6 weeks for blood or 90 days for sperm after your last administered dose. 
It is recommended to avoid using mycophenolate during pregnancy due to its potential to increase the risk of miscarriage in the first trimester and cause birth defects. If you can become pregnant, it is important to take a pregnancy test before initiating this medication and regularly throughout the course of treatment. Effective birth control measures should be taken if either you or your partner are capable of conceiving. It is also recommended to continue using birth control for a minimum of six weeks for women and at least three months for men after completing your last dose. Can this medication interact with other medications? Some medications that may interact with mycophenolate include stomach acid reducers, such as esomeprazole or omeprazole, antibiotics such as amoxicillin or metronidazole, or antiviral medications such as acyclovir. If taking magnesium or aluminum-containing antacids or cevelomer, while also taking mycophenolate, it is recommended to take them at least two hours apart. This ensures that the medications do not interact with each other. There's lots of information on mycophenolate, immunosuppressants, and other health conditions on our website, so check out our blogs in the links below. You can even save money with your prescription by purchasing it from our Marley Drug website. We offer free home delivery and competitive prices. And if you have any questions, just drop them in the comment section below and don't forget to subscribe. Bye for now.